doing good out there. Hope y'all fine. I hope y'all in the best of health. I experienced my first earthquake, man. I kept trying, kept failing, game plan, kept changing, dreams fading, started heaven. Tell you how it all happened. It, it was listen, man. I, I'm from the Bronx, New York, where shit happens, man. But not that. That's that's different. That's that's a whole different animal, bro. Um, it was a uh, the earthquake lasted 38 seconds, and the epicenter was at a place called Monte I, I, I'm in DR right now. Uh, I'm in the Santiago area. But I, I, what what I did? Oh, I went to like a a tobacco uh, factory, the biggest one in Dominican Republic. It's called the Aurora. I went for a tour. With some uh, with some of my friends out here, and uh, we uh we was chilling. I remember we ate lunch. Uh, we was eating lunch, and there was like uh, they already served me and all that. Then I just feel the floor moving. I feel the, the floor shaking and like moving to the side and the plants were falling and and I was like what the hell's going on here and then one, one of the ladies that was with me was like yo the floor is shaking uh, we going through this is an earthquake right now and the crazy thing is that I felt it but I, I'm staying in a high rise for the first time usually when I come out here I just I just rent a crib and have my own private pool and just chill but I wanted to stay in, in, in a place where we had like a rooftop and we could just chill for a different experience, right? But um, I remember just those 38 seconds was just like, shit was just like shaking. And, and your ears feel funny, like the air changes, which is it's weird as hell. But um, it, 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 I, I thought about like Haiti and Turkey and all these places, Morocco, where they had like, uh, you know, these earthquakes and it's just in a matter of seconds, bro. Shit could just go for the worse and get ugly. You know what I mean? So um, it was it was funny. It was it, it was funny, but a little scary at the same time. I ain't even going to front. I ain't even I ain't even going to stunt, man. But uh, it, it was awesome. It, 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 this, it's been an awesome trip. Um, I'm out here in Santiago right now, in, in, in the rooftop that I'm staying in. I love that right there. I love the mountains. I'm a, that's why I love the West Coast, but I love these mountains. And I always came to DR, but I never came to what they call Cibao, which is like the San, the Santiago area, you know, La Vega, Bonao. Um, but that's the monumento over there. But, um, you know, um, I wanted to just share that story with y'all and let y'all know uh, my experience with the earthquake situation, but it's crazy, man. Enjoy life, bro. Be all gone in 38 seconds. Everything could be on the floor, especially out here. I was talking to a journalist, a, a guy that does uh, that writes for the newspaper, and he was telling me that um, they're expecting a big one, like a seven, a seven point something or eight point something. I think at that point, I mean, no buildings are no no buildings is designed to withstand something like that. But um, yeah, man, scary, scary. So yo, enjoy life, and you know, uh, that's about it, man. I just wanted to share that story with y'all, man. Thank y'all for watching. And don't forget to tell a friend to tell a friend that we're here, man. Cost TV. Uh, God bless you guys and go in peace. I kept trying, kept failing, game plan, kept changing, dreams fading, started hesitating, couldn't deal with the agitation, it only led to the aggravation of not having the ones who had some things to stunting and bluffing, had to create my own path, my own luck, found my